All right. GY is a pair of digital glasses that helps you stay connected to your digital services while still let you focus on the real world. I'm Will Wang. I'm the founder and CEO of Even Realities. I'm minus six, so pretty much without glasses, I'm yeah, blind. So the first thing I would do every day when I wake up is to reach for my glasses. So I have a pretty high standard for eyewear. GY is actually our attempt at building the next generation of glasses which we think should be digital. Yeah, so when you're wearing it, it actually provides a virtual display two meters away from you to provide you some simple but really practical functionalities such as navigation, translation, teleprompter, quick notes, and also, of course, it's connected with AI. to engineer the state-of-the-art technology into a truly stunning piece of eyewear design, we know that we need to have some superstars from the eyewear industry. Glasses need to be light, adjustable, wearable, comfortable, and then they have to be looking good at the same time. I have been approached before from other technology companies but none of them have really showed me the way and the vision which will get. Eyewear is much more than just a necessity. It has to look good and you need a lot of good functions. And for that exercise, we needed one of the best designers that was available in the market. We got the best eyewear designer out there. In our industry, there's this sentence that says, Either you wear the frame or the frame wears you. When we first started with this project, we were already like uh, on the same page. What would be the best fit for the entire world? It's a panto shape. And this panto shape has a lot of advantages because it fits an enormous variety of faces. It's not entirely round. You could just cut off something here, something here, and something here. And all of a sudden you had that triangular shape. The intention was to make it as filigree as possible, hiding a bulk of technology that was already very minuscule. One big task was to make this like, side piece or temple as thin and as minimal as possible. Uh, Philip pretty much showed that he's really good at blending the rational part and the emotional part of the design. If you want to be iconic, then make it as iconic as possible and don't go too far away from it. And that's what we try to do with G1. The glasses was in the center point. Basically, we should be able to sell the glass without the tech. The tech is the add-on that makes your life easier. By connecting to your phone, G1 provides you the essential digital services while still help you uh, focus on the real world. We use a word or a sentence called undisturbed connections. Instead of looking in the mobile phone, we want to be looking at the person we are with in the room. And we definitely don't think a screen is our enemy. We just think that we need to find a more sustainable way. So we build this company apps on your phone, uh, which allows you to control and customize your G1. And I was skeptical, I have to be honest, for the tech side, because that was my biggest worry. Is this going to be an overflow of information right in your face? It is not. Our team is also veterans in optical engineering. We've worked on products like cameras, laser projectors, different kinds of optical sensors. House is our most important technology, which is helping us enabling the product. It uses waveguide display technology, which means that you have like two micro projectors projecting out to the waveguide layers in front of you to provide the best image clarity in the most power efficient and space saving way while it's also eliminating any discomfort traditional waveguide might carry. On top of that, we use the best uh, digital surface lens technology to produce your prescription lenses, which is much more customizable uh, than traditional ways of making prescription lenses. So after that, we pretty much combine the prescription layers together with the waveguide layers, making it as unnoticeable as possible ensuring G1 to be your perfect pair of 
everyday glasses. The EV reality concept is a new jump into the future. There's always this urge in humanity to go a step ahead, né? to see, okay, this might be the glasses that the next lunar expedition is going to use. The eyewear industry has like hundreds of years of history. So there's so much stuff for us to respect, to learn, to appreciate. But on the other hand, this industry has stayed the same for so many years. We think it's at a turning point where a revolution is about to happen. And we believe the essence of making an ideal pair of digital glasses is to really learn from and respect the traditions of eyewear industry while seamlessly integrate the technology into the glasses to the right extent, balancing out the physical and digital and making both realities even.